Hi Leo. This is going to be your reading for the 3rd until the 9th of February 2019. Check your moon, Venus and rising. If the messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insight. And I'm picking two winners this month for Valentine's. I'm picking one male, one female. So leave a comment to let me know whether you'd like to win the Romance Angels Oracle cards or the Psychic Tarot. By doing so, you've entered. So, what message do we have for Leo? Mental conflict. Let's see what's going on. Leo. February 3rd to the 9th, love messages. Love messages for Leo. Ten of Wands, sorry. Yeah, Ten of Wands. Releasing a burden. You're carrying a weight on your shoulders. Oh, you have feelings for someone. Two of Cups. Definitely have feelings for someone or feeling a connection, but you feel torn. You needed to make a decision, mental conflict, going back and forth in your mind about something. Seeing them as the devil, so you could be dealing with someone who has Capricorn in their chart or any sign but it's showing up here they could be like you know addicted to you or maybe obsessed ish like or codependent some of you could be dealing with someone who's codependent that could be why there's such a burden for you let's see they're seeing you as a knight of wands so it's almost like they're obsessed and you're like hiding because they're so like, or maybe they're someone's overbearing. You have the tower as you know how they feel. Mm, intense feelings for you. The ace of wands. So. Yeah. They want a new start or they want, you know, they, they really want to ignite this passion with you. Okay, the page of wands. So between the both of you, there could be passionate communication. It's almost like it's too much, like this person may be opening up too much or seem too attached or seem too straightforward. You know, like Capricorn type being straightforward, um, serious. Let's see, we have strength here. So we have you, your card. Let's see why it showed up. Okay, why the two of wands here? Sorry, the two of swords. The two of swords, the mental conflict. Things may be... Mm -hmm. You're probably concerned that this person may be slightly uh, manipulative, maybe worried about their intentions. You know, you may be worried about their intentions for, you know, moving so fast. Some of you may have not met this person yet. The Two of Cups.
Definitely, it's moving really fast. You almost feel like you're on, like, you could feel like you're on this roller coaster that just keeps going and going. You know? You may. Let's see. The devil, why is the devil here? This person may be codependent. They could be keeping secrets. Or holding back on how they feel. Maybe you don't know that they are codependent or that they are obsessed with you. Some of you may know, some of you probably don't. Because you have the four of pentacles, they're holding something back. It could be that, you know, they've just gotten out of a relationship or a marriage and they haven't healed. The Ace of Wands. There's the devil again. Again, there could be... Um, a lot of fire here. Some of you definitely dealing with uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. But, or well, they could have that in their chart or any sign. But here we have the devil again. Then we have the, the five of wands in reverse. So they may want, someone may want a new start with you. Someone, it could be someone that you broke up with or are separated from. That they are obsessed. Or they're codependent. Like they can't, um let go there's a tower here I'm bring you their love seems like this person could be codependent okay especially if they have gotten out of a relationship from the past that they haven't healed from so be careful of that that's a nine of wands here They may see you as, you know, avoiding them, but still hanging around. Like maybe some of you may have, haven't blocked them or cut them off, but you are kind of, you know, being kind of standoffish, some of you. It could be vice versa. It could be dealing with someone who's avoiding you. And you could have passionate feelings towards them, but mainly I'm seeing that, that you're avoiding someone. Why is the Page of Wands here? Again, someone who's codependent, emotionally, um, just, just not stable. Just not stable. They they have issues that they haven't worked on from the past. You might want to be careful of strength. You may have to channel this Leo strength here. Wow. Some of you, it could be a brand new relationship. Well, not relationship. Well, someone that you're talking to or involved with. Some of you it could be a relationship, an ex, an ex spouse, someone you're separated from. But mainly, you are 
realizing or seeing through this person and possibly staying strong throughout, especially if you're married and you have no choice but to stick through and, you know, leave this person um, slowly. Some of you are definitely going to need strength when it comes to dealing with this person, this type of person who is, you know, codependent. They they don't they don't really want to heal or haven't took, taken the time to heal let me see what's going on with leo situation involves marriage some of you it could be a marriage that um where this person won't let go or they are obsessed or manipulating you is calling for you to have trust let your friends help you ask and accept support from others attraction to attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully basically just to stay positive to trust if, if it's you who has the codependent issues codependency issues then may need to learn to trust for the future there is no need to worry everything is working out beautifully past life the situation involves past life memories Don't back down, stand up for what you believe is right. Some of you could be going through a divorce, a nasty divorce with someone who is like this, you know, like the devil. Some of you could be someone new that you're talking to who hasn't healed some issues that they have that may affect you, so you have to be careful. Even though you feel a connection with this person, they may have all these hidden things going on. True love, the romantic stirrings in your heart have propelled the universe to deliver great love to you. Those of you who have heard this message before, like on another video from someone else, then yeah, I will take it serious. But if you haven't, maybe watch other readings and see. Like the moon, Venus, or right and rising or another reader to see if it's the same thing because it doesn't have to be for all of you and it doesn't have to be this extreme for all of you okay accelerated motion hope Emotional withdrawal and destiny. So some of you, this could be a part of what leads you to your destiny. You know, the little things that happen that make you stronger, for sure. Some of you, it could be a narcissistic situation that you went through, that you're coming out of, which has made you stronger. You know, accelerating forward. Hope, emotional withdrawal. Being able to, you know, pull away and be strong in any situation, you know. But yeah, this may be, especially if it's a past life situation, definitely could be coming back to teach you in this life. But you have to stand up for what you believe is right. So if this is an abusive situation or men uh, mentally abusive, emotionally abusive then you know that it's time to go. If you've been in this situation for a while, you definitely need to have strength this, this week. Okay. But I do feel like some of you will be rejecting this person with the Ace of Cups in reverse because you do have, you know, releasing the burden here. So all of this mental conflict, this could be them. You could be dealing with someone like this who is not... Quite, as I said, like some of you could be dealing with a narcissist. 
you know, they're not really quite right up here. Uh, some of you just dealing with someone who has a lot going on behind the scenes that you don't know about. But don't take this as confirmation. Make sure you've um, like seen signs of this already or you know, you've, watched, you've heard this message before on other readings. Okay. So, Leo, just be careful with this type of person. It does seem like they are a little bit too attached or too, you know, it just doesn't look right. It doesn't look right. You know, it doesn't look like this person, for a lot of you, is okay mentally. Not that they would have a mental illness. Some of you, this person may, but it could be that they just haven't got over their ex or are still hurt from the past. And it may affect you, so you don't want that to to interrupt your life or to affect your life, okay? But it will teach you a lot. Or probably already has taught you a lot. So, Leo, this was your reading for the 3rd until the 9th of January, not January, February. Check your moon, Venus, and rising if the messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insights. Also, if you'd like to be one of two winners, let me know what deck you'd like to win, the Romance Angels Oracle cards or the Psychic Tarot by commenting, you've entered the competition. So, like this video if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already, and thanks for watching.